am I on the wrong one, the right one? I don't know. Yeah, what, what happened? So I did the stock swoosh one for Skype, and it, it didn't connect, but I did oh, yours okay. with just your name on it. Yeah, so. that's okay. Anyways, oh. I just wanted to, I wanted to do a video with you last week about Tesla, but then, oh then well, well, tell me where you're at with everything right now. Okay, so for the day trades, I'm out. I'm at a Ford and I'm at a Snap. It when it when it lingered down there at seven seven sixteen, what is it seventy? I said sixteen seventy five. And then it was so close to noon. I said, you know what, reversal time. I don't want to be in this till three. So I got out, but but I, I you know I did great. I made seven hundred forty five dollars. So it was great. Yeah, very good. So that was and, a good one. And then yesterday with Microsoft, I made four hundred dollars. So, so it's two good day trades. Two good days. What did you right. do with the options between yesterday and today? So the options, I got out of Microsoft. I got out of half on Friday, and I got out of the other half yesterday, and I made about eight hundred dollars. That's good. Yeah, and then Apple. Maybe I get out a little too soon, but I made three hundred dollars. Okay. What about the markets? Uh, the market, I got. I didn't take the cues because I was in the Apple, but I took the SPY. I took two contracts of the SPY, and I was out. I didn't wait for the close because I wasn't going to be home, mm -hmm. so I got out of four hundred dollars. Okay, that was good. And what? Yeah. That and Amazon was a thousand. Was, Tesla has now made me brave to take Amazon. Ah, that's funny. <laughs> well, great. So did you get out of that into the the open today or yesterday? Or no, what did you do? I got out yesterday because I was up a thousand dollars. Okay, very good. Yeah, so I read that good um, amount. And then did you kill the Disney this morning or you let it through I and let did it ride? Spires next Friday and by the time after we got our shorts, I, I usually have a, a limit in a 70% return on investment, mm -hmm. but I didn't this time because I was going to watch it and I didn't watch it and then it went down. So Well, I tell people if you want to kill it, you can kill it because right. of the fact that the way that it broke, it wasn't going to go right today. But I, but if you hold every one, you can hold it. It has time. So I don't think right. you, there's no, there was no, that like, wasn't going to save you that much if you get out of it. So it's like right. you want to wait and wait it through, you know? So, yeah, I figured it expires next Friday. So that kind of gives you almost like a week and a half. But that just dropped like a brick. I And that Shocked. really surprised Shocked. me last night because yeah. they had really, they were all tuned into the subscribers and they had a good subscriber number. And then initially Disney bounced and was up to 148. And, when, and I said to myself, oh, here we go. It's going to probably go up to 150. I was shocked when I got up and looked at this morning. I was like, and I didn't call anything new in it this morning. So I'm glad. No, and I watched it last night until 6.30. And it was down It was down to where it closed. Oh, I didn't it's even look like at it that late. Friends. It was so weird. Yeah, it was weird. Anyways, okay, so to explain to me what you did with Tesla's last week and then Monday. What did you do? Okay, so uh, I, I actually wrote you all the options. So I'm just going to get out my email because... Well, just tell I, me what you were thinking. You, I mean, I know pretty much what you did because you did send me the email. Like when we did them and then it only had a little bit and then that was Thursday and then it was Friday, but then we rallied into the close, like I said, on right. Friday. Right, you did. It, yes. It, it did exactly what you said. So I... I had an option and I got out of it, but another option to see what would happen with it. And that, and that's what I did. And so, um, and that was the next day. And that was when I was up, I was up, I had two, two contracts and I was up $6,000. I so mean, did you let it ride though into the day, right? I did. Yes. I took a new one. So I, I kind of banked the profit from the one okay. as it was going into the close. And I took another one okay. to kind of go to the next day with it. That's so what I did. So then Monday was the big day. Did you let those ride or did you get I out did. of them? Okay, good, I good. I let them ride. And then I got out mid-morning. Okay, that was fine. Yeah, that was still a good exit. Yeah, and then the ones you called yesterday, I took a thousand. Okay. And, and I actually got out at 800. Oh, you did? I did. Oh. And then what I did was I took we took another one. And that's the one I still have left now because yeah. I figured even if between Amazon yesterday and the Tesla yeah. and with all my other options, it kind of, I'm still green. Even if the, it cost me $23, I think, even if that goes bust. Yeah, yeah, from, yeah. yeah, definitely, definitely. And I'll call other trades. I mean, there was nothing yeah. today, but there'll be other things to do. But anyways, when you saw 
the gap up and test a Tuesday morning, did you feel regret from getting out of the Monday? You would have doubled your No, I would have doubled no because I, I almost felt like you did. Like, it just, it gave us so much money. Yeah. Ha- it, it's, there was no regret. Yeah, I, yeah. I, With $10,000 and taking one contract, there's, there was no regret for me. I, I've never had days like that. Yeah. So when you, so overall, what did your husband say when you told him? Oh, that? he, I think he going to fall over. <laughs> <laughs> when I said I'm up like eight thousand dollars at one time, he went what? Oh, that's funny because he knew you took one. Yes, yes, and then there was one. Oh, I forget what day it was, but you called it. It was going into the close, and it backed up a little. It was one of my last ones, and then I said, I remember what you said to me about options. Uh-huh. Don't take them when they're going down. Yeah. But when when they start to go back, when they start to go up, yeah. go with the momentum. And I took a second one, so I actually had two. That was lucky. I kind of mitigated my price. Yeah. And, and that's the one that I was up eight thousand dollars in. Yeah, yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. Well, that was kind of like yesterday when I saw that saw it around lunch, which I, mean, I haven't looked at it in the last half an hour. But I mean, who knows with that? Like you said. But overall, right. the whole months from the beginning of the year until. This week, what was your total profits in Tesla for the whole year so far, 2020? I, I think I think twenty thousand dollars. I know it's crazy. Twenty thousand dollars. <laughs> I know. I mean, it's just it's uh, and it's, it's funny like an account my, my, for some people. My daughter's dating a boy who mm-hmm. is uh, going to be a CPA, uh-huh. and he had Tesla, and he needed money. So right before it popped. Uh-huh. I think he sold it. He bought it like at a hundred, yeah. and he sold it for three hundred, and he made it out good. Oh and then God. he's watching. He's going, "Oh my gosh, what did I do?" But you know, you got to take profit. Oh so. yeah, definitely. Now is he doing? He's actually just buying the shares outright. He just he bought. Yeah, he just bought the shares outright. I said, you know, if you if you want, when you're ready, if you yeah. want to like listen to Melissa. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah. I, yeah. I had like a hundred percent conviction that was going to seven hundred, and then on Monday I said it's going to go through seven hundred. And you just like, at a certain point, you can see like, and yesterday I knew it was going to hit the 950. So yeah. at a certain point then, you just, you kind of got to watch it and see where it's going. And that day that the market was selling off and Tesla was just steady Friday, as a rock. Friday, yeah, Friday. And that's the one where you said it's at three o'clock, it's going to be at 2.30 and I'm watching them going, oh my gosh, I there know, it goes. It's like, seriously, like, I'm, I'm like, I'm so on point lately. Now, Facebook, Thank what did you do with that one? You made out in that Friday then too, right? I, I did that. Oh, that was beautiful. That was beautiful because the day before we got stopped out, so I, I, I wrote you that email and yeah, I said. Yeah, it was a revenge I, trade. I forgive you, Facebook. Yeah, that was you. funny. I know. But the, but the option, did you hold the option too? I only, you called two options in that. The, they were like a week apart. No, the one though I called with a day to go. The one was fr- Thursday to Friday. The other so one was I Monday. didn't take that option. I don't oh. know why. I just didn't. Okay, all right. Facebook, I, I kind of don't like, I, I, and I'm getting not to like Netflix anymore either. I used to love Netflix. I, I think Netflix has been a mess this year, to be honest yeah. with you. It hasn't done anything that it seemed like it should be doing. In fact, I looked at that and thought about Klein Long and that with everything else yesterday, and I chose not to. I chose yeah. not to because I'm like, ah, uh, you know. But I mean, these things will work themselves out and fix themselves. But Disney is very disappointing. I think it would have, if it would have gone over 150, it would have been great. It could have done yep. it last night. It could have done it this morning, and it's very, very unfortunate. And it's all, and it all has to do. I, I you know, I've, I've listened to them talk, and it, it really all has to do with that virus. The fact that they closed down Disney Shanghai and they closed down Disney Hong Kong. Yeah. And that's where they're going to lose a lot of money. But I'm telling you, we were just in Orlando. Ben and I went by ourselves. Mm-hmm. Disney was hopping. It was it was it was 42 degrees. Breeze in Florida, and yeah. we were all lined up for the Star Wars ride. So, I mean, there were thousands of people. Well, I they're anticipating the loss they haven't had yet. So, I guess that's what made it made Maybe. it made it bump. Maybe. So, overall, I, now, so is Ben just letting you do the options then? Yeah, I'm doing it all. Yep. I'm doing it all. <laughs> And what's funny is we went out. So after I made all that money on on Monday, he goes, "We have to go out to dinner." So <laughs> I got my wine. He got his beer. We cheered and we said, "And I said, this is to Elon." <laughs> <laughs> and if I could record that for you, like, oh my god, that's funny. That's funny. That's funny. And then I he went shopping. I'll be able to buy Teslas. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> the hundred thousand dollar car. You're insane. And here we are, right? 
shorting poor little Ford today that's worth eight bucks. I know. And, I mean, it probably has, goes has, to eight thousand. Yeah, it's it pro- crazy. I know. It probably does go to eight, but I mean, it, I, that was such a snail, which I kind of knew this morning, you know. It's so sad that it's worth nothing. I know. I know. And then Tesla is like, the, you know, the shiny new kid on the block. Well, times and, are changing, that's for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Well, but I think it's you're, wild. I, I think you're doing great. This is the best month that you've had ever, this right? The best. And even some of those, I, I got a little aggressive last week b- before the Facebook. What are we losing? A win. I think we oh, lost a win. win. And I got yeah, a little too aggressive failed. myself. And I just said, you know, I got to pull back again and, and just do what I was doing. So that, so I did. And so I'm having a great week. So, so you're, and I had a great week last week because Facebook put everything right. Yeah, it definitely, definitely did. So you're, you, you kept your risk the same now for day trades. You've upped it a little for the options. I, I, I and I've upped it a little for day trades. So oh, I was did. at 200 and now I'm, I'm between three and four. Okay, yeah. good, good, good. Because I have that newer platform, which I love. And that and when I changed that platform, it took the monkey off my back. Yeah, yeah. But now look and at how the money you made. How much what? And look at how the, all the money you made when the stress was off you. Oh, my gosh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because it's like you have this this $25,000 that, that really zero because you can't do anything I with know, it. I know, but it's really you have a lot of money. So then it's so stupid yeah. to say if you have $24,999, you feel like you don't have any money if you have to send a buck and yeah. cut you off. So it's just it's too stressful. If, you, if, you're, if, if you're worrying about it every second, that's why profit yeah. counts really for people. Sometimes it just takes the monkey off your back, like you said. And, and you had that class that day, and that's when the light bulb went on. And I talked to Ben about it, you know, and because yeah. we he had listened to everything before and considered it and said, well, we have to send the money to England. And that kind of yeah. put him off. And I said, you know, what Melissa said today really, really made a lot of sense to me. And ever since then, I, I've been in a different, it's a different ball game for me. Yeah, that's great. That's fantastic. Yeah. Well, you're doing great. Keep me posted Thank on your you. progress. I love getting your emails. I think I think all the positive comments really helps people, helps motivate the people that are that are not there yet. Like the one guy in the room, he didn't put a right. stop in that one trade at all. He 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 just didn't put a stop in one. I've been there and done that. I, I and I think it's because he has the account like I had, and so what he's thinking is, if I put the stop and get stopped out. Then I have to come up with money to get back over my limit again. I know, I, I know exactly what I'm thinking. I was in the same spot. Yeah, exactly. And like, I mean, like obviously, like today, one thing like snap can be huge. Then and then, if you yep. can't take it, and you're worried about something, like either they're gonna work or they're not gonna work. Really, the bottom line is like, and we know pretty quickly. I mean, if I can't tell in the first five minutes, I feel like at least within the first fifteen minutes that they really need to go. And if they don't. Yep then they're just like, they're gonna they're gonna flip around. And then there's just no point and we look at something else. I'm glad that we didn't go long Disney though today. I watched it, I watched it, it could have gone. You did, it just, you did. You know, the right no, thing and I like, I like the way you, you've even, you know, you're, so you've taken a step back and you're willing to watch something for that three to five minute window because yeah. The market's been so crazy that something might look like it'll work and then all of a sudden flip. So, yeah, oh, yeah. stops are very important. That. Taking your time, thinking about what you're doing mm-hmm. and having a game. I, I, I try to incorporate all those tips. So yeah. you're right. Even if you're on the option letter, to be in the room is just huge. Yeah. It's just huge. Yeah, I definitely think it helps because I felt like the market was up a lot today. And I felt like it, it, it was going to sell off. Not that we're not higher the rest of the week. I don't know. We could be. We could. We might. I don't know. But it was just like a, I didn't expect the move up as big as it was this morning. Right. So I felt right. Like shorting was the right way to go. Yeah, it was. So thank you. <laughs> All right. Well, listen. Tell Ben I said hi. I, I felt 